We're here to celebrate the creation of this pin, uh, which will allow law enforcement officers to be able to uh, wear it because they normally they have to wear a uniform shirt. But they wanted to participate in Pink Shirt Day too, along with everybody else, to show their support for protection against bullying. Uh, and so this gives them the opportunity to do that while uh, raising money to create an anti-bullying program to give people the skills to be able to deal with uh, bullies that they encounter. We're community role models, and we need to support those that are being bullied, and they know they have individuals, officers, emergency response people that are backing them up and that, and that we support them. You know, there's suicides and then there are behaviors that directed outward and where they, others will harm people because they are victims of bullying. And uh, so it is certainly there and cyberbullying is, is very much new and but certainly it will have some ramifications, there's no doubt. Today is about giving a voice, support and hope to young Albertans who have been bullied, are being bullied, have witnessed bullying, and for all individuals who will become victims of bullying in the years to come. Today, social media has made escaping bullying seemingly impossible for too many young people. There's much more to say about bullying, but suffice it to say, as a psychologist, I believe this is one of the most pressing mental health and community issues faced by young people in our province today. Every sale, of our pink shirt pins provides funding for Big Brother Big Sister agencies across this province of Alberta to deliver the important education to parents, to volunteers, and to children about bullying, how to resist the negative influences, and how to work through issues that arise from bullying situations.